Hi everyone, I'm Danielle Walker, and today I'm going to re be reviewing the Food Saver for you. Uh, the Food Saver is made by the good people at Sunbeam, and this is a two-in-one unit. What it does is it vacuum seals um, food and meat and anything that you have that you don't want to go bad. So what it does is it sucks up all of the air and then it heat, heat seals it. So <clears throat> I'm just going to take a little look here. This unit, you open it up and here you have the rolls of bags. This is going to be the first step you want. You're going to have to buy these bags. Um, they come in a little box like this. They're 11 inch bags. You get two rolls. They're about $20. So the first thing you want to do is obviously plug it in and turn it on. And then <clears throat> there is a space for these bags. You put the bags in, you feed it through this little green handle here. I know it's a little hard to see. And then there is a little black knob that you pull towards you and it's gonna cut the paper. So I'm gonna do just a little example here for you. You know, I've got this roll here. I'm gonna cut a piece off. So now what I have is just plastic bag and stuff, all on both ends. Um, basically what I'm going to do is create a bag here. <clears throat> now, the machine comes with many functions. It comes with this, just a seal. It can, um, it's got a section for dry or mo moist food. And then it also has this little nifty handy dandy cord here. You pull it out. It works with special made Ziploc bags. What you would do is just put it on here like so and it just sucks out. It also works with special made food saver Tupperware. You just put the this on the special made valve that comes on the Tupperware and you push the accessory button and it's going to work the same way. It's going to pull it on the air. <clears throat> it's going to vacuum seal it. It's going to make it last longer. Your lunch is dead fresh. They don't taste stale. Um, and it's just retractable, and then it just sits right back in its little carrier here. It's a little difficult today. There also is a marinade function with this little accessory piece. Um, once again, you have to use the Tupperware that is made for the food saver. So what it's going to do is it's going to take and suck all the air out of the Tupperware, leaving only the marinade that you have in there which saves you hours of marinade time. <clears throat> now down to the good stuff here. So I've got the bag here I've just cut off. And what I'm gonna do is I've already turned it on. And right now all I wanna do is seal one end. I'm basically just gonna make my, my bag here. So I'm just gonna hit the button that says seal here. <clears throat> and you'll notice right here there is, I know it's hard to see, but on this end it's green and over here it's red. It's gonna tell you your progress. So let's see if I can show you here. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to stick this in and it's going to censor it on its own. All I do is put the bag in and you'll hear it move and then you just wait. And what it's doing is it's warming up. It's going to seal, seal that one end. <clears throat> While it's working, I'm just going to tell you a little bit about the machine itself. So. You can buy this machine on the Food Saver website for about $199, which I know sounds a little expensive, but that is the whole kit. You get bags, um, you get the machine, you get the bags, you get the Tupperware that comes with it, you get the special made Ziploc bags for the accessories. <clears throat> it comes with this little handy, you know, booklet that tells you all about it, how to use it. Um, it's going to keep your food fresher for up to five times longer than you normally would with just a regular Ziploc bag. Now, okay, so what I've got here is I've made my bag. You can see it's heat sealed on one end, so now I'm ready to put stuff in. So I'm going to do an example here for you. I've got these carrots. This is a perfect example. Once you open the bag, the bag is open you know you can roll it over you can put it in a ziploc bag but you know the bag of carrots is open so <clears throat> i 
So I'm just gonna put my little carrots in here. I hate it when my carrots get dry, so. So now I'm gonna go ahead and seal the bag. And what I want it to do, if I wanted to just seal the bag, say I had something I didn't want vacuum sealed, like um, breads or something like, something crunchy you don't want crushed, I would just hit the seal button. But since I want it to vacuum seal and seal, it automatically is gonna do that for me. <clears throat> so once again, all I'm gonna do is slip this little thing into its little you know, feeder down here, and it's gonna sense it for me. You hear it sense it, makes kind of a weird noise. Now it's going to stop, but they tell you that you don't want to pull it out until it releases it. So I heard it release. Let's see. Yep. I heard it release. So now I have these carrots. I know it's kind of hard for you to see, but it's, it's hard. All the air has been vacuum sealed out, and it's got this great little heat seal on it. Now I've made it big enough to where I could cut it open and reseal it again. It does take about at least an inch and a half for the machine to sensor it once you put it in far enough. So I've got these little carrots here. Last night I had some leftover steaks from dinner. I did these steaks here. Um, another great thing I have here is this bag of cereal here. You know, this is a bag of honey bunches of oats that I've got here that I want to seal. I don't want to put a, a clip on it, you know. I want it to be fresh. So what I'm going to do here is I don't want to vacuum seal this bag because if I vacuum seal it, it's going to crush it. So I just want to seal it closed. So I'm going to hit the seal button right here, which tells it I only want to seal and not vacuum. What I do, I stick the bag in here and I can hear it sense it. This part's nice and quiet. I love it. It's working. You know, I know it's hard to see, but you can see the progress. You know, it starts over here, it's green, and then it goes red. And it just released. And now my cereal has this great heat seal on it. I know it's a little hard to see, but it does, you know. It's not going anywhere. You know, my bag is nice and tightly closed. This product has been amazing. It's something that I had always wanted and was able to find um, for a really good deal at a flea market. Um, I know they sell them on Amazon. I know they sell them at retail stores. And they're probably going to be a little bit cheaper than if you were to go to the Food Saver website. This thing is great. It's sleek. It looks awesome in my kitchen. It doesn't take up a lot of space. You know, I haven't been buying Ziploc bags like crazy. You know, I'm able to buy a whole lot of meat at one time and keep it fresh until I need it, which has been the greatest, you know, saver of all times. According to the website, it says that it's going to, it could save you up to $2,700 a year just by plastic bags and not throwing away food that's been rotted because it's going to stay so much fresher here into this little machine here. It's really great, you know, all the parts are detachable, the lid is detachable, this little um, handle here, you know, is detachable, this tray uh, pops out right here like so to clean it, it's got a, like a little drip tray in here, it's fantastic. All it does is plug into the wall right here, you know, it doesn't take up much space, the whole unit is probably, you know, a foot and a half, two feet long, um, it just looks great. That's the one thing that I love about it. It's so sleek. Everybody comes over and they're like, oh my gosh, what is that? It just looks really cool and it's a great money saver. <clears throat> so this is the Food Saver 2-in-1 vacuum seal and heat seal machine. I hope you enjoyed my presentation. Thanks so much. I'm Danielle Walker and today I'm going to re be reviewing the Food Saver for you. Uh, the Food Saver is made by the good people at Sunbeam and this is a two-in-one unit. 
What it does is it vacuum seals um, food and meat and anything that you have that you don't want to go bad. So what it does is it sucks up all of the air and then it heat, heat seals it. So <clears throat> I'm just going to take a little look here. This unit, you open it up and here you have the rolls of bags. This is going to be the first step you want. You're going to have to buy these bags. Um, they come in a little box like this. They're 11 inch bags. You get two rolls. They're about $20. So the first thing you want to do is obviously plug it in.